next on five, a local high school student disciplined for using racial slurs, but one parent says the punishment doesn't go far enough. This in response to a viral video on social media recorded at Baker High School in Mobile. WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones spoke to the father of the student targeted by those slurs. Jeremy? Yes, so I spoke with to the father of the student harassed in the video. He is not happy with the way the school district handled what happened. Now we don't have permission to show you that video, but we've watched it and can describe what it shows. In the video posted on Facebook, a Baker High School student is seen leaving a lunch table after another student says anti-black and anti-gay slurs. Baker's father says he was shocked to learn about this, not from the school, but from social media. So right now the way it's affecting my son, he didn't want to go to school. He was crying. I prayed for him. I told him, man, this is a mean world. Brandon Baker says his son didn't know he was being recorded. He says his son saw the video on social media and reported it to the school. Baker is upset because he says the school didn't contact him. I saw the video, man. It hurt my son. It hurt me. And it touched the community in a bad way. <sighs> me as the parent, his grandmother or nobody was called. The administrator, the principal didn't call us at all. The way we found out, the parents found out, was from Facebook, and we was mad. According to Baker, the child who called his son slurs was suspended. We reached out to Mobile County Public Schools for comment about the incident. Spokesperson Renee Phillips sent us this statement. I cannot comment on anything specifically as it involves minors, but we have handled it in accordance with our student code of conduct. Baker says he's received a lot of support from people on Facebook. He wants his son's story to encourage other children who face discrimination to share their story. I want everybody to stand up, talk about it, share it, get into the community. Baker says a suspension isn't enough. He wants the other student expelled. Right now, Baker is thinking about placing his son in another school. Reporting in studio, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.